how many times do you feel happy in your day? How many times do you actually get sad in a day? Disappointed, nervous, frustrated, stressed, this. So what is your normal frequency? Your usual frequency is the negativity. Is it your fault? Let me tell you, it is not your fault. It's a fault of your environment. Can you change the environment? You cannot change the environment, right? So what can you change? You can only change yourself. Okay. How will you change yourself? By being more aware of you. By being more aware of yourself. How will you become more aware of yourself? Okay. Let me ask you a simple question. Okay. How many of you have actually taken your hands and put on your face in the last one hour? Okay. How many times did you smile? On what statement did you smile? This is called the awareness. What statement will I speak which will not go well with you? Understood? This is called the awareness part of it. Now, how will you develop that awareness? Because if you're not aware of your emotions, you will never be able to manage the emotions. If you're not aware of the emotions, you will never be able to understand the emotions. If you're not aware of the emotion, you are not understanding the emotion, you will never be able to be intelligent about that, which is called the emotional intelligence. Knowing your emotions, understanding your emotion, managing your emotions, and same for others, it's called the emotional intelligence. So how many of you actually make a to-do list every day? Do you make the to-do list for yourself? Some people make it, some people don't make it. Now, how many of you are making a list of your emotions every day? So just like your to-do list, if you start making the list of emotions that you go through during the day, during the day, that will give you the awareness of your emotions. Now the awareness will bring the understanding. Understanding will bring the management. Management will bring the control. Control will bring the communication. Communication will bring the impact. Impact will bring the result. Reward. These are distinctly looking words are connected to each other. So if I have to actually ask you yesterday, since morning when you wake up, till you slept in the night, how many emotions did you feel? At what time, which emotion was there? Everybody remembers what Sarukhan did in Javan. Do you remember yourself? Is the question. If not, then start jotting down. That is why the journaling helps, where you actually note down your emotion in that. Okay? You do not remember because you do not note down. Now, how many times to note it down till the time you become aware? That many times. So how many times you have written the tables? One, one, za one, one, two, za two. Kitni baar likha tha? Jab tak wo na aa jaye tab tak. So that is where you need to have the awareness because then your awareness will be driving your understanding and understanding will drive your management. Now, once is the awareness, yeah, there is a understanding. Now, how many of you understand why do you feel sad or happy about things? Why don't you put your hand on the stove and be happy about it? We know what will happen. How will you know that what will happen? How many of you have seen children actually playing with the fire? They don't even care. When you experience something, that experience is giving you the memory. There is an emotional memory attached to that incident, which is in your mind, that to an unconscious mind, it gets revoked when the incident repeats. Making sense? What you call as a muscle memory, correct? So when you put the hand on the stove, your muscle memory says that it will feel hot, it will hurt me. So, zap. But that was through the experience. Now, how many of you are afraid of fear of failure and uh, you say, I want to snap out of the failure? You should first put the hand on the stove, no? You don't want to put a hand on the stove and say, I'm afraid of failure. How will you be afraid of failure when you have not seen the failure anyway? How will you know how to fail as a CEO, senior manager, general manager, AVP? How will you know that you will not be able to handle the team? How will you know that you will not be able to present to the CEOs? How will you know that you will not be able to handle the management position? Borrowed fears, isn't it? Past failure, past failures only give you the learning. What have you learned? In fact, if the person has failed once, he is wiser. Do you all agree with that? Yeah. If the person has failed in something, he becomes wiser. The wise people should try more, isn't it? Or try less. Who is better at actually managing that things? The wiser people or uh, the people who have not even tried? You know the answer, right? Because you're logical, rational. Your conscious mind is very active right now. Correct? So your conscious mind is taking the information. But let me tell you the limitation of conscious mind. The conscious mind will take the information and evaporate. It's a gajni memory. It only remembers the things in chunk. 
in the small quantity and it can only remember that much at a given time. So what you need to do is you need to train your conscious mind. I want you to remember this chunk at this time. I want you to remember this chunk at this time. I want you to remember this chunk at this time. How will you do it? By reminding that conscious mind every day, by setting up a goal and the vision for yourself, by reminding the conscious mind, this is my goal, this is my vision. This is my goal, this is my vision. This is my goal, this is my vision. This is the action I need to take. This is the action I need to take. Now, how do you, how many of you believe that if you remind your conscious mind to do this, just like your to-do list, it will work? Because your to-do list work, right? You work on the to-do list every day. Have you wondered why you are working on your to-do list? Because you are reminding your conscious mind, this is to be done. Same way for your life, for your career, can you remind yourself that this is to be done? If you remind your mind that this is to be done, it will do it. But do we remind? is a question.